Well, Lord continues to remove a boat that slammed into a Hollywood jetty early Tuesday. We are also learning more about the passengers on board who were injured. Local 10 News reporter Jeff Weinsier is live with the details tonight. Jeff. Alex, the 47 year old man operating the boat is a high level insurance executive who lives in a $10 million house here in Fort Lauderdale. The boat now here behind me at Cable Marine. In fact, you can see the flybridge sticking up there. That is the boat that slammed into the jetty. New pictures of this million dollar boat now in dry dock at the center of an investigation. A Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission report says those on board all have permanent addresses in Indiana. However, the man operating the boat, identified as 47 year old Daniel Taurus, also has a home on the water in Fort Lauderdale. 32 year old Lauren Salegi, the mother of two, according to her Facebook page, was ejected, sustained serious injuries, was rushed to Memorial Regional. Her 39 year old husband, Jarrett, also ejected from this boat. 25 year old Cassidy Rudman of Indianapolis was also on board. The 42 footer slammed into the South Jetty on the Hollywood side of the Port Everglades Inlet as the boat was coming in. It took tactical crews to get to the victims. FWC is conducting an investigation right now to see what factors were involved that led to this scene. And we just checked with Memorial Regional Lauren Salegi in stable condition. We should tell you the FWC report is not specific. It doesn't say if empty alcohol bottles were found on the boat or if toxicology testing was done on anybody on board. The good news here is that no one was killed. We're live in Fort Lauderdale. Jeff Weinsier, Local 10 News.